Hello, it's Holly with Ivy Co Creations, and I am doing another 14 Days of Christmas. Please check out the description box below for everyone who's playing along with this hop. It's so much fun. We post every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday, and there are some people who are just posting whenever they can, so it's a great way to get inspired. And we're doing all winter and slash Christmas layouts, so if you work within the time frame or like if you like scrapbooking at Christmas of Christmas photos join along it's um, it's so much fun now this layout I am also using the scrap a sketch sketch which I will post in the one of the corners um, of the video and so we also have a recipe that we're supposed to follow with this and I think I got five things on here um, but I'm I'm more just using the sketches um, than following a recipe but I do love the way this one turned out I simplified it a whole lot because the original sketch has like Five different pieces of paper on it and um, different layers and stuff like that and I didn't want just a plain boring there's supposed to be a frame around the strip of four photos and I didn't want to cut my photos down um, they're already small and I didn't feel like cutting them even smaller so I ended up just going to the basics of the sketch and leaving it pretty simple but I did fussy cut the center of these two frames out these are from 49th and Market and they are I don't know they come in the um, ephemera packs so there's always these are from like two different collections I think um, but they come in the ephemera packs as large embellishments so I just cut out the middles of these cards and turn them into tags basically or a frame and I love this I love the snowflake paper that's like my favorite thing and I had these four photos of my son playing in the snow with my daughter and I just love the way they turned out and that the frames the frames really accentuate the photos and make them pop and I know I'm using florals on a winter layout and I'm using florals on my son's layout that always happens I do my daughter's layout first and she gets the more masculine or the more basic and then he ends up getting the more floral and you know over the top layouts <laughs> maybe I'll do all his photos first <laughs> but anyway I pulled out some of these little embellishments we're supposed to have on the sketch you're supposed to have journaling clusters at the top and the bottom um, but because my frames almost touch the bottom of the page I just went with below the photo and up where the title is and I was going to use the big title that said winter, but I didn't like the way that it looked. I'll definitely use it on something else though. I have so many winter layouts. Um, and I have this tag that had an ampersand and some flowers on it and I didn't want that so I just covered it up. Put a snowflake right on top. <laughs> That's how you make things work for you. It's the way to do it. I have the Cardabella Snow Day sticker sheet and this is all that I have left on it and I used um, the winter stories from I think it was that one simple stories one of the simple stories ones I'm I have like three more sayings or something on that simple stories one with the yellow it was a winter collection. I think it was called Freezing Season, but it was a winter collection and it's full of pink and yellow and teal, which is fine. 
But it's really hard for me to use a lot of pink for Christmas. I just, I'm not a fan of pink as is, but whatever. So I only have a few things left on that sticker sheet and I will, I will use them up. Maybe I'll dig through and see if I have any cut aparts or paper that will coordinate with it and just use it up. It literally, I literally have like four stickers left. <laughs> that, that'll be my goal. This 14 days of Christmas hop, that'll be my goal to use up those stickers from the freezing season collection. <laughs> anyway, on the layout that I'm working on currently, I went through and I just stuck these little circle stickers of snowflakes all over the place. I just wanted it to look like it was snowing. And I just went at it. I tried to stay away from color, but I had, there was one teal. So there's a teal one and a blue one, I think. And then the most are like little blue circles and stuff like that. But I love the way that this turned out. I have these beautiful periwinkle blue sequins that I love and I probably am going to run out of soon. But I use them to just accentuate the sparkle and shine that I wanted so that it looked like it was snowing and I just love the way that it turned out so much fun to create these layouts so please come join us it's so much fun I just love these hops where you don't have to do anything really except scrap your holiday photos and it just inspires me to get things done and I love it <laughs>